Alrighty guys, uh, welcome back to part 12 of my Pirate 101 playthrough. Now, uh, part 11 or 12, I'm not, I can't remember, let me just double check. Um, let's see, I need to start doing this first, I really do. Okay, part 12. Anyway, um, welcome back, I... Uh, Last episode, we, um, just got to Puerto Rico and just, I guess, I think we recruited Rapier last, last time? Pretty sure. Anyway, um, yeah, as I said that last episode, I was going to either show or skip this, the ship combat. Because, like, it's not really that enjoyable to watch it personally. So, I think I'm going to show the first ship and then uh, skip the other two. Because, again, it's not really that enjoyable to watch. I still need to find myself a sail. That's kind of annoying. Um, But, yeah, the other thing is House Gizman ships are over here and over there in between the... Uh, Skylings. As just a little heads up about that. Sorry, uh, this episode has taken so long to uh, come out and everything. I really do apologize. And I'm missing more than I should be because of how close that ship is. He's in the yellow. I need to get some accuracy for my ship. I really do. Of course you're going to be coming over here. Stay back. Stay back, I tell you. Stay back. Maybe I should equip that other wheel. You know what? I might as well just join their ship, right? And my ship died. I'm a flippin' idiot. Okay. So, um, yeah, I'm a flippin' idiot. I'm just gonna probably skip the rest. Oh, seriously? I'll catch you guys back after I do this, okay? Alrighty, I apologize for the delay on that. I uh, just finished, and yeah. Well, for you guys, it's going to be an instant, but, like, it actually took me a good few minutes. <laughs> ah, here is the silk. No doubt my competitors will miss it dearly. <laughs> I took the liberty of making this suit while you were gone. It will fit, don't worry. I delivered it to the governor's palace. The major domo has it. <sighs> here we are. We're going to be... Have ourselves be made a fool of, be made a fool out of ourselves again. You must be here for your suit. It certainly took you long enough. Here it is. Oh, you look marvelous. My cousin Sastre the tailor has done you proud. You're ready to see the governor now. You may proceed upstairs. Good luck and do try to behave yourself. I can dress you properly, but I fear I'd never make a monkistan out of you. <laughs> and yay! That moment we are made into a court jester. Oh, my little great tail has something for me. Nautical XP! Yay! Well, Captain, you 
certainly look... Uh, well, you look... Uh... Ridiculous, Captain. You look ridiculous. Those monkeys are making a monkey out of you. I know, right, Bonnie Ann? Greetings. You're very bold to come here wearing last year's fashion. You've come all the way from Skull Island? What are you, a pirate? A treaty? How fascinating. I shall give it all due interest and respect. Do you have a gift? I'm honored. This chalice is uh, very fine, I'm sure. Ah, I see now. You are expecting to see Governor Ortega. Ah, I fear he was declared a traitor to the realm and sealed in a dark pit. So sorry. It has been pleasant speaking with you, but my duties demand my attention. I shall consider your treaty closely. The Major Domo will have my answer. Uh, they're not gonna consider the treaty at all. His Excellency is too polite to directly refuse, but I assure you, he will never sign your treaty. His answer is a no. Your gift was an embarrassment, to say the least. But there may be something else you can offer in return for signing your treaty. I know who you are. You are the pirate who robbed the Presidio, yes? There are some who could make good use of your boldness and cunning. Seek out Bishop Hidalgo in the cathedral. He may have an offer that will interest you. <laughs> but for pity's sake, don't go dressed like that! Thank you for allowing me to change clothes. God dang. That ridiculous outfit. I swear. <sighs> Greetings, child. I trust you are not here to pray. We have much to speak of. I know your errand, and I know that it is doomed if left to formal channels. But, on a more informal level... A task must be done, vital to the crown. The demands of honor make it impossible for any Monquistador to do it. But you are no Monquistador. Well, this is... yeah. The islands of this cluster are covered in ancient ruins whose mysterious builders vanished long ago. Nobody knows who they were or what they were doing, but they left a legacy inlaid in the living rock of their temples. Gold. The Monquista came to Skull Island before any of the other nations of the Spiral. The gold we pry from these ruins makes us wealthy and powerful. Bold Monquistadors led the conquest of Skull Island, but one name outshines all the rest. Gortez. We owe him our wealth, our influence, our very empire. Almost a year ago, Gortez embarked on his latest adventure. I am asking you to follow him into the very heart of the Isle of Doom. Do not be afraid. The island is named after its discoverer, uh, Baron Ferdinand von Doom, who was unfortunately devoured by a giant snake. I hear the island is a very pleasant place, as long as you avoid the swarms of carnivorous bees, flesh-eating plants, and the savage frog tribes with poisonous skin. I have no doubt you'll do very well there. Gortez was drawn to the Isle of Doom by rumors of vast treasures on that shadowed island. At first, Gortez was triumphant, as always. He and his troops cut a swath into the jungle, crushing all who opposed them. Gold poured out of the jungle, more gold than ever before. But in the months that followed, disquieting rumors reached us here. Gortez, they said, had lost his way and was doing questionable things. Four months ago, all contact was lost with Gortez and his army. Their fate was not known until a Monquistador came staggering out of the deep jungle, raving with fever. He said Cortez had built a kingdom for himself in the jungle and ruled it like a tyrant. He had also found something wondrous, the gold monkey, a treasure beyond reckoning. You 
must act where our strongest cannot. Go to the Isle of Doom, find Gortez, and bring him and this gold monkey to the governor. Succeed? <sighs> I will ensure the governor signs your treaty. Go to Arroyo, the outfitter. He will prepare you for your journey. Alrighty, uh, so that's that. Alrighty, so... Yeah, we're about to go to get... Go into the Temple of Doom. This is gonna be fun. Also, I apologize for any lag you might see. I am currently having to do something... Uh, that, um, yeah. That'll help me know how long to record and all that jazz. So, you go to the Isle of Doom. I hear it's a lovely place. Provided you keep clear of the monster spiders. The skyways near the island have grown very dangerous. The scurvy dogs and the hungry fish make the place too difficult for most ships to approach. When you sail there, I ask you to take these food supplies to the gold miners. They've been cut off for weeks. You'll be a hero to them. Alrighty, time to go to Foreman uh, Salazar. <laughs> It'd be kind of funny Sal if his name was Salazar Von Sweets or something. Just, just a funny reference to a movie. I doubt anyone, most will get it. Okay. Gold mine is where I need to go, and that is where I shall go. Hold up. I think I disabled something that I want to re enable. Yeah, I wanted to actually show that. Wow. Okay, let's go to open up chat at least. Close it a little bit. Minimize it a little bit, but yeah. All the same. Alrighty. Uh, honestly, maybe I should cut out travel time as well, just so I can, re just so I can give you guys more content within the game as well. That might be good. I don't know. I really wish you guys would give me more feedback, but hey, not much to be, not much can be done about that. I'll admit. Really, dude? You're invisible? Okay. Thank the saints you are here. We've been so long without good food. We were about to eat our clothes. Welcome, Captain, to the Isle of Doom. It's a lovely place if you can avoid the brain-eating parasites. Uh, don't drink the water. You came to find Gortez? We used to send search parties looking for him, but now we have other problems. Our water mole laborers are revolting. Pshaw. They may be short and a bit stinky, but they're hardly as bad as all that. No, I mean they are in revolt. They're attacking us. As soon as we broke into the tombs under the ruined temple, all our workers turned on us. Can you help us? Punish these rebels and defeat Haku, their leader, and I'll tell you what I know of Gortel. Haku, their leader. Okay. Gotcha. I'll do that. Right over here. Okay. Let's see, how can I aim this? Not like that. I don't want to aim it like that. Let's have you do that. Let's have you do this. 
Okay. I think I've got more stuff to train, actually, now that I think about it. Honestly, I'm not too worried about it. Alrighty, so let's see. Let's go ahead and place a trap right here as well. Let's go ahead and have her shoot him. Have Bonnie and now do this like that. Let's then go ahead and move him right there to try to beat more to come over. Alrighty, so there's that. Wow, is that guy still not dead? Seriously? Seriously, that... Really? Really now? Really? How much health? Seriously? Two health. Wow. Just, wow. Okay, Bonnie and you're up. Just in case Bonnie and fails. This guy's guaranteed dying to me. That's why I didn't really care. And she crit on him. Okay. You may be able to defeat us, but you will never be able to defeat Haku! While Haku stands, our revolt continues! <sighs> yada yada yada. I don't care. I don't care enough to deal with you, stupid water moles. There's some water moles that are actually cool and all, but like... You guys are just dumb. Sorry to say it, but you really are. <sighs> so now to make my way into the ancient tomb to find a Haku. Haku, Haku. Let me guess, he's at the very back? Yep, I've got a long trek to do. I think I'll actually, um... Yeah, I'll see you guys when I get over there. Alrighty, I'm sorry about that abruptness of that. And... Yeah, let's just go ahead and get into this. I kind of got pulled once or twice, but... Hey, that's that. Right? No biggies. I don't think he wanted to see me get pulled like an idiot. <laughs> probably, probably not. I don't know. But either way, I don't... I'm kind of you running short. You are too late to help the monkey lords. Soon, the old ones will rise. Okay, sorry about that. Anyway, yeah, I'm kind of running late on... Low on time, so that's kind of why I want to save time... And everything since I do 30 minute recordings and all. You guys understand, right? I hope so. I don't know. Agility. I think I could. I'm just gonna actually move her by up one tile and uh, then trap this spot, I think. I should probably place down my barricade. Should probably place down my barricade in the other spot, so that way I can trap them in there. So where they only went a certain path. 
le leading into the traps and everything. Yeah, I should probably should have. Actually, in thinking about it, I can't target that apparently. So let's go ahead and put that right there. Have her target this one. Actually, no, I need to put this right... I can't put it right there. God, this... L I am lagging up unnaturally right now. Blow you up. Isn't my only goal to defeat Paku? Rise, ancient ones! Rise and help us! Alrighty, now I'm pretty sure I'm set to... I don't need to kill everyone, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I just need to defeat the Aztecosaur mummy. Over there, way in the back. Alright. Good to know, good to know. That's fine, that's perfectly fine. Let's have Bonnie and Snape you. Let's go ahead and move you up times... Move you up two tiles... Okay. Probably just gonna defeat the others just cause like, it'll make it a little bit easier on me. If you guys understand what I mean. Let's go ahead and use that agility. Have you shoot him. If you shoot him and you natural attack that, that should work out. Okay. Now the melee is got guy is dead. Okay, so now what old does that dude have? Overwatch, double tap, and quick adjust. So if we dodge, uh, we're getting hit again. If we move into range, we're getting hit. If he crits, we're getting hit. There we go, he's dead. So it doesn't matter either way. You didn't even get an attack off during the that. The old ones, they poisoned my mind. Made me do terrible things. I am free now. I thank you. I must make peace with the monkey lords. Alrighty, so I need to go talk to Foreman Salazar again. Alrighty. I'll see you guys when I get over there. Sorry about these constant cuts, but like... Actually, couldn't I just do this? That's the Isle of Dunox. That works, actually. Um, never mind. I'm not gonna cut this out. I apologize for almost doing that. It's perfectly fine, perfectly fine. What are these side quests? Oh, greetings, Jack. Lock, take rubbish. Finally. Bring me back golden statues from the tunnels under the ruins in Ew. the deep heart of no. the jungle. I no. can repay you, Han. Stranded in the sky in the dark. <sighs> I'm much too injured to rescue my crew. But I've got booty I'll exchange uh... if you take down Marleybone ships and find the barrel. Sure, but I'll stakes. do that on my own time. Sorry about that. Uh, sorry about that little distraction.
I actually need to disable that as well. <clears throat> Those two have side quests as well. I should probably take a look at them. Oh, you've done it! I will give you gold for this out of my personal share. I will also help you on your dark mission. Gortel. I met him once. I don't know what has happened to him. There are, I think, things in these jungles that apes were not meant to disturb. The gold monkey? It is a statue of a solid gold, taller than a tree, an amazing find. But I hear that it is cursed. It may be Gordez's doom. I can put you on the path his army took, nothing more. There is an outpost up the trail. Talk to Criado there. He'll know where Gordel is. But be careful. That's Trogi country. And the Trogis, don't let their looks fool you. They are not kind to trespassers. Alrighty. So currently it's been about 26 minutes of recording. I'm going to uh, cut out the travel time to get to where our, my destination is sorry about that and then i think i'm gonna end it off there once i talk to credo anyway see you guys there Alrighty, sorry about that i kind of triggered this dialogue before i um you know started recording again but oh well looks like the truggies made short work of this place let's look for signs of survivors and where they might have gone Okay. What's this? There's a message carved on this stool. Here's what it says. Trogis destroyed outpost. Cling to cave southeast of here. Send help. See. Si. Aha! Triado, he has left this note to the cave. Alrighty. Uh, so I'll go ahead and go do that real quick, and then I'll end it off there. I apologize for, um... The constant cuts I made this video I do hope you guys give me feedback on what you think of them I think I did a horrible job honestly but I want to know how you guys feel about it and what you guys think about it uh, let's just get into this cave and then uh, yeah You have found us! We are saved! And it's only you? You are not here to rescue us? This is bad. Very bad. We are doomed for certain. The Trogis will eat us all! So why are you here? Gortez? He's east of here, but the way is blocked. Swarms of bees let no one pass. The gold monkey? It is a wonder, a great tapestry of metal thread, hung with thousands of gold plates and countless emeralds. It is with Cortez. We are trapped here, between the bees and the Trogis. Criado said he knew a way to pass the bees, but he is gone. The frog devils took him. Criado may yet live. If you hurry to the Trogi village, you might save him. And if you scatter the Trogis, that would be a boon to us. Alrighty, well, either way, this is where I was going to end it. I think I'm just going to check these two side quests over here first. Two nights ago, we were attacked. How are we to survive without weapons? Mm. You look well armed. Yeah, Can no. you recover our weapons from the jungle? Not that. When we first built the... We are so hungry. There's a foreman. Mateo yeah, no. Just Sorry. Now at the gold mine to the south. Tell him of our dire okay. situation. Well, he anyway. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I hope my uh, constant edits didn't, like... Don't phase too many people. Again, sorry. And I hope you guys uh, enjoyed And I hope to see you again for part 13. Peace out, my di- My guys. Everyone. Sorry, that was cringy.